Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. And today I've got a nice comparison for you. We've got the Hot 42 S13 here and the Hot 42 M13. So we're going to take a look, put them side by side and compare, you know, the pros and cons and see what we like. So let's dive in. So first the S13, I've been using this for a good week now and I really like this controller. I know my hands are big. I don't necessarily fit. But what I've been doing is I've been using a small like little Tupperware lid. I put it right in the middle and it fits perfect on my lap. My hands grip the sides and these buttons are so quiet and so soft. I don't know what it is. They're just really nice and easy to play with. Everything's right there. Uh, my daughter's been loving this controller. Just not only design, but just she really likes playing with the controller. She likes it a lot. And it's been really fun. Uh, I'm going to leave this here. I'll put this to the side. The M13 has been really nice also. I like the bigger buttons. I like how cold it is. And I've been doing the same thing. Put it right here. And this fits really well on my lap. This is wide enough. And this base is really nice um, to play with. They both have the... Side over here. Both have the two up buttons you can see. Um, these buttons are the smaller buttons. And again, I don't have my notes in front of me. So they're the 25 or 20 millimeter, whichever the smaller ones are. And these are the larger. So either 25 or 30, I don't remember the top of my head. Um, this button here is the larger and these are all smaller, whereas all of these are the same size, right? And I really like these two controllers. They are, they're just really nice. So if you already know you like this size and the feel, you know, I like the M, the, the metal build quality and the larger buttons, the texture, everything feels really nice. I really like this. If you need something more affordable or you're just really wondering, do I even want to play in this space? And I'm torn between the M and the S. The S is nice because the price is right just to dive in and see if you like it, right? And the customizing is so easy. Just unscrew it. I'll probably make another video showing how I changed the artwork. You have your, you know, your custom screens that we did, all the different things, the, you know, the cable manager, um, we're playing right now with the Magic Boot, but we also play with the PS5 Brooks, the PS5 Mayflash, and on the Xbox, the Xbox Mayflash that's backwards, and then the Magic Boot. This was really the one we liked the most. And we're trying to get more of these, but these are very hard to find. But these just plug right in the side here, and it's nice build quality. It's, it's firm, it's in there, it doesn't bend. Whereas this, we don't like to play with these inside because, you know, if it's on your lap, it can, it's really fragile. It wiggles a lot. And we do not want to break it inside the controller. And the lag, it does add one to two milliseconds. But I mean, if you're playing on a sandwich button or any other button, you, you know, there's this lag everywhere. So again, this fits right here. It's really nice. But we like it, right? We like both. So if you're asking which one is better, it really depends on you. Um, this, you're paying more for the build quality and the slightly larger, well, more than slightly, the larger size, right? So you, you can see the footprint here. It's almost a button and a half taller and about a button and a half wider. Um, they're both pretty much just as thick as the other. They are basically the size of a cell phone. Like they're maybe a little bit on, in the case, like they're not really that big, which is really nice. But this one is so nice to take, just throw it in your bag. I mean, a guy's pocket, it will probably fit into a guy's pocket. You can slide it in. If you're going to an event or just going out to a fight club night, right? You just want to have play some games. You can throw this with you and have no problems. This one is perfect too because it fits right in your backpack. Or if you're carrying it, you don't worry about breaking it because it's made out of metal, right? It feels, it's pretty sturdy. It's going to hold up. And this feels just fine. It does not feel fragile at all. You know, everything feels really well put together. I'm happy with both. So if you're on the fence, what you're really going to be considering is, do you want the smaller buttons or the larger buttons that are slightly more spaced out, you know, and all those different things. Um, the weight is practically the same when you're using them. And do you want the larger footprint on your lap? So if you have a Tupperware container, do not be afraid to get the cheaper one and just put this in the middle and use that. You're going to be so happy with this. And then as you save up, you'll be ready to upgrade to this one here. And same difference, right? Let me move these out the way. You know, same difference. If it's if you need more space, you can put on here. Otherwise, you can put this on your lap or a table and you'll have no problems. They both do a really great job. Um, yeah, I think you're going to like them both. So this is the M13, the S13, the S13 from the Hot 42. And thanks for watching. Bye.